What is good y'all? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm reviewing Jennifer's Body directed by Karen Kusama and starring Megan Fox and Amanda Seyfried. This movie is currently available on Amazon Prime with ads. So just search Jennifer's Body. It'll come up. There's only about four different ad breaks in it. So not a big deal. This movie came out in 2009 guys and I was in college. Early 20s guy. Megan Fox was in her absolute hotness prime and full disclosure i only wanted to see this movie back then just to see her there looked like some amazing scenes with her i went to go see it and i was obviously i went for that reason you know terrible but shallow reasons but i'm halfway through the movie and i'm watching i'm like this is actually a good movie it's like legit good so i got it on dvd when it came out still held up then i watched it uh, for this review so 12 years ago this movie came out and it still holds up very well pretty cut and dry plot it do this is a movie that does everything well in my opinion it doesn't try to do too much but it does everything very well this is a great movie to get started out if you just want to like wet your feet in the horror it has a little bit of everything so megan fox plays jennifer who is the smoking hot cheerleader at her high school her friend childhood friend is needy played by amanda seyfried she's kind of just the regular girl but they're still very much friends that's all well and good until jennifer becomes a succubus with a bloodthirst for every guy in her school and that's pretty much the movie uh needy's really the only one that sees it and it comes to a great climax at the end at prom and that's that's pretty much the movie it's pretty pretty cut and dry but that ride is a fun ride both of those characters have amazing arcs um one starts out as kind of a you know just your regular everyday girl and she has to embrace her dark side and jennifer is kind of forced to embrace her dark side it's it's got great kills it's got great scary imagery it's got likable dumb characters needy's the only one to know what those is going on jk simmons has a great little cameo in the movie uh again the 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 makeup looks the kills are good the story is simple, easy to follow. That's what you need in a horror movie. Too many, too many of these types of movies today, I guess you would call this teen horror. They try to do too much. This movie doesn't try to do too much at all. It just stays within what it is and it does it well. Jennifer is, Mega Fox actually does a really good job. I mean, obviously she's smoking hot in this movie. Most guys, myself included, went to go see it and we love the makeout scene. I mean, but aside from that, obviously that, that works, but you have great, two great female characters. Jennifer is the villain. Needy is the protagonist. Again, the hero, the final girl, we have, that's a common trope in horror done well. It's, it's just a very well done movie, easy to follow, very much fun, great date movie. So if you want to, if you're, if you're on a date, sitting at home, want to watch something easy or just by yourself, Jennifer's body, easy to watch, uh, very fun ride. Guys, I will be putting up a community post with um, what you would like me to review next. Again, I'm going to focus on movies that are available to stream. Hope you guys are having a great start to your fall. Take care. I'll see you all soon.